Manufacturing of Tablets The manufacturing process of tablets involves several steps, each carefully controlled to ensure the production of high-quality pharmaceutical products. Formulation and Blending The formulation stage involves selecting the active pharmaceutical ingredient, API, and excipients required to achieve the desired properties of the tablet, such as stability, release profile, and manufacturability. The API and excipients are weighed and blended in appropriate proportions to form a homogeneous mixture. This blending can be done using equipment such as ribbon bun blenders or high shear mixers. Granulation Granulation is the process of forming granules from the blended powder mixture. Granules improve the flowability, compressibility, and uniformity of the final tablet. Granulation can be achieved through dry or wet methods. Dry granulation. In this method, the powder blend is compressed into large granules without using any liquid binder. The granules are then milled to achieve the desired particle size before compression. Wet granulation. Here, the powder blend is mixed with a liquid binder, usually water or alcohol, to form wet granules. The wet is then dried and screened to obtain granules of uniform size. Drying. Granules must be dried to remove moisture before further processing. Drying can be accomplished using equipment like fluid bed dryers or tray dryers. Particle sizing. The granules may undergo additional milling or screening to achieve the desired particle size distribution, ensuring uniformity in tablet weight and drug content. Compression. The dried granules or powder blend are compressed into tablets using a tablet press machine. The machine exerts pressure on the granules within a die cavity to form tablets of uniform size, shape, and weight. The compression force and dwell time are controlled to achieve the desired hardness and disintegration characteristics of the tablets. Coating. Optional. Some tablets may undergo coating to improve appearance, taste masking or modify drug release characteristics. Coating can be applied using various methods such as film coating, sugar coating, or enteric coating. Film coating involves spraying a thin polymer film onto the tablets in a coating pan or fluidized bed coater. Quality control. Quality control checks are performed throughout the manufacturing process to insist to ensure that the tablets meet specifications for attributes such as weight variation, hardness, disintegration time, and drug content uniformity. In-process testing and sampling are conducted at various stages to monitor the quality of the tablets. Packaging and labeling. Once the tablets pass control checks, they are packaged into bottles, blister packs, or other suitable containers. Packaging materials must be selected to protect the tablets from moisture, light, and other environmental factors that could affect their stability. The packaged tablets are labeled with essential information such as the name, strength, dosage form, expiration date, and manufacturer details, in compliance with regulatory requirements. Overall, tablet manufacturing is a complex process that requires stringent controls and adherence to good manufacturing practices, GMP, to an e to ensure the production of safe, effective, and high-quality pharmaceutical disclaimer. This channel does not promote or encourage any illegal activities and all contents provided by this channel are meant for educational purposes only. Any copyrighted material on these slides is included as fair use for educational purposes only. It will be removed at the request of copyright owners.